Hello, and welcome to a video on how to manage your Minecraft backup features. A backup feature allows you to set up an automatic system to make backups of your server and files when you require it so that your data will never be lost and is always accessible. This guide can also be applied to other games we offer. The first step is to go to scalacube.com and log into your account. Click on Servers and then Manage Server. Automated Backup System If you've purchased an automated backup system, click on the Backup System on the left tab. Click on Add to add your first automated backup to the list. Here you can select your game server, scheduled time, interval, and what to do if you run out of storage space. If you run out of storage space, you can either select Delete Oldest Backup or Stop Creating Backups. Once your chosen settings have been selected, click on Add. The backup has been added and will automatically work at your chosen time frame. Clicking on Details on the Backup System page allows us to change the existing settings of the feature. To tell the system to make a backup now instead of waiting for the process to automatically happen, click on Backup. Here you can also change the specifics of the automatic backup and also delete an existing one. If we go back and click on View Backups, we can see our list of backups made by the process we set up. Clicking on Restore Backup will upload the existing backup to our server. To download a backup made by the automated backup process directly onto your computer, go to FTP Users and use your backup FTP credentials found under Details to log in to an FTP client. Right-click your chosen backup and select Download. The backup has now been downloaded directly to your computer. Manually managing backups. If a backup system is not purchased, make your way to Game Servers and click on Manage. Scroll down until you find your FTP credentials and log into your chosen FTP client. Once you have logged into the FTP client, make your way to Server and you can now download any files in your server by right clicking it and selecting Download. You can also replace the existing world folder with your own if needed. Congratulations! You now know how to manage your Minecraft backup features. Just in case this video is not fully explained, I have also put a link in the description to the Scalacube website to the same guide explaining the same method step by step with images. That is all for me today. Have a nice day. Goodbye!